and everyone. <coughs> what the hell was that? I think that was a furball. <laughs> yes, should we start that again? <laughs> Hi everyone. <laughs> it's Big Paul here, and um, it's a new Blu-ray hunt today. Oh yes, baby. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get to do a Blu-ray hunt yesterday on Monday, but we are doing a fresh one today, Tuesday. There aren't really any big titles out this week anyway, but um, I'm going to go and have a look in the shops, have a look in Tesco's and Sainsbury's and Seahawks, if we can get there, and Powerland, and uh, Edinburgh. Oh, yeah. What? Yes, we're going to pop into HMV and uh, have a look, see what goodies there are, see if there's any discounted shit and all that kind of stuff. Yes, so anyway, let's get going. Um, I'm already at my first location, which is Tesco's in Folkestone. No, it's not. It's Tesco's in Ashford. So let's go in, have a look, see what new titles there are, have a look at the DVD shit and um, let's see if there's anything worth picking up. Let's go and have a look. Okay, so usually when you turn up at a shop, there's usually some kind of sign on the roof. Well, I don't know if you can see it, but where's my finger going? But Tesco sign is right underneath that clock. <laughs> Cheapskate bastards! Get a proper fucking sign! Ooh, how much did you spend on that? About £1.50. Okay, so here we are at the Blu-rays. Let's have a look, see if there's anything here. Uh, nope. Uh, that's all last week and the week before. Mm, okay. All right. Oh, well, I've looked at the DVDs. What have we got on the DVDs? Nope, nothing. Oh, we've got replicas with Keanu Reeves. Uh, I think that's something to do with cloning or some kind of shit like that. That's new. We also have the Justice League, the Fatal Five. Okay. Anything else? Oh, we're going to get into weird territory now. What carries carries Marta? Looks like a horror film. Mm, not familiar with that. Uh, Life itself. Oh, with the lovely Olivia Wilde. Uh, oh, this was on Sky as well, on Sky Cinema. Haven't seen it yet, though. And uh, Johnny English there. Uh, of course, we've got the usual rubbish sci-fi. What's that? For those that missed the X-Files. Okay. Interesting. And 303 Squadron as well. With a green case. Very nice. And that's £7. Got anything else down here? Iceman. Okay. So a bit more martial arts action. The Time Traveller. And you also have Furious, Game of Thrones meets 300. That sounds good, actually. I bet there ain't a Blu-ray for that. Okay, so I think that's about it on the DVDs here as well. Uh, I was mistaken, there is a Blu-ray out. Uh, the Justice League, The Fatal Five. So well hidden, couldn't bloody see it. Uh, yeah, one of the animated uh, DC movies. So that's £12 on Blu-ray, so... That's not bad, but that looks like it's the only thing in Tesco's. Let's move on. Okay, so didn't pick up any Blu-rays, but picked up some pot chips and some Diet Coke. So let's go back to the car and go on to our next stop. Okay, so our next stop will be HMV and Poundland. And then we'll swing by afterwards, have a look in Sainsbury's. So next stop, HMV. <laughs>
Okay, so they didn't have what I was looking for, specifically Cujo, the limited edition, not even on the HMV computer in there. And also Planet of the Apes, uh, the, the trilogy is on 4K for this week only. I think it's supposed to be £15, but comes up as 34 95 on their computer, so can't get that either. Okay, so nothing from HMV. Right, okay, let's move on to Poundland and have a little look in there, see what there is. Okay, so next stop here at Westwood Cross, Poundland. Let's go and have a look. Please, surely they must have some new ones by now. Let's go and have a look. Okay, uh, well there are quite a few in here. Don't know if there's any new ones though. Got a couple of ones there. Let's see what we've got here. Planet of the Apes, yeah. Mechanic. I'm not sure they had that. I don't think they had that before. There's Argo. Expendables. Uh, Interceptor. Battleship. Transcendence, I know that's a new one for this store. Oh, I've got Lion there. Not the museum. I think these are the same ones along here that we were in a couple of days ago. But uh, there's a couple of boxes, so I'm just going to drag them down and have a look, see what's in them. Well, that was disappointing. There was a couple of boxes there with some newer titles in, but Pacific Rim and Kill Bill, but nothing really special. So we just need to go into a card factory. I need to pick a card up for Lulu's birthday in a couple of days. Let's go and have a look, see what there is. Okay, so out of HMV and Poundland, and I found a card in Card Factory for Lumu for someone special. So many times you've brightened my day with your presence. So many times you've stopped a tear and turned it into a smile. So many times you've said, I'm here for you, then gone ahead and proved it. And there's a load more waffle inside. So, uh, yes, really happy with that card. £1.49 in Card Factory, that's not bad. And it's got a couple of little stuck on little hearts and some nice gold foil and all that kind of shit. I wouldn't worry about Lulu seeing the card um, in the video, even though it's her birthday in a couple of days. She's got more chance of getting stuck in the quantum realm than seeing my videos. <laughs> Okie dokie, right. Let's uh, move on to our next stop then, shall we? Okay, so let's move to our next stop, which is... Is... Or Sainsbury's. Okay, I can't see myself coming out of here with anything, as it's been a really slow week and there's hardly anything out at all. If HMV hasn't got the ones that I want, Sure as hell Sainsbury's are not going to have it. But they have been selling some Easter eggs off cheap, so you never know. Might come out with an Easter egg for 50p. <laughs> and we can only hope. Let's go and have a look, see if they've got anything. Well, no, as I expected. There's nothing out this week, so definitely not anything up the top of the escalators. It's a very weak week this week. It's a very weak week this week. <laughs> Let's go over and have a look at the Blu-rays and the DVDs, but uh, I think it's going to be a quick stop. You want a Pikachu? Pikachu? Mm. Oh, yes. Oh, i tell you what I have noticed here. <gasps> Toy Story 4. Toy Story 4. Oh, so we've got Woody. And we've got Bo Peep. A 
and some little fluffies here as well. What is that? Must be one of the new ones. Hello Blu-ray section. That's absolutely bare because there's nothing out this week. Apart from Justice League versus the Fatal Five. 12 pounds, how to duck. But that comes in a bigger bag, a bigger box. It seems to be only the thin case, but it does come in like a collector's box. We have Swamp Thing here with a limited edition case in the 2 for 25. Okay, over on the DVDs. Now, uh, apart from Life Itself, Pokemon's three feature length movies, Pagan King, some Star Wars DVDs here for £7 each. Plus we also have the 303 Squadron, which I watched the trailer, it doesn't look that bad, but I think I'll probably wait for it on Netflix. And also the replicas with Keanu Reeves, plus also Furious and the Justice League Fatal 5 DVD. Another little selection here on the end of the aisle for Blu-ray bestsellers. They've actually moved a lot of the 4Ks. They've got some 4Ks around the side there, but they've expanded it. So in the £20 or 2 for 30 we've got Braveheart there and Arrival. Plus Spider-Man Homecoming, The Dark Crystal. And Inception, Ready Player One, I don't believe it. Now available for £15. Bugger. Plus also Tomb Raider there as well. Jurassic World, that's the original. And down here we've got some of the John Carpenter Blu-rays, now £10. And we have First Man and Venom. Okay, I know it might be a little bit too soon, but all of these 4Ks that are in the 2 for 30, it's only a matter of time. Yes, as soon as this drops in to the 2 for 30, I'm picking it up, hopefully with a slip cover. Of all the bloody cheek, bloody cheek. I just come out of Sainsbury's, um, I just had to pick up a few groceries, but I had one carrier bag. And you know when you're trying to squeeze every kind of piece of shit into that bag that you possibly can using every little corner? I mean, it was bursting at the seams. It was like, it resembled me at a Chinese buffet. You just couldn't stuff it with anything else. And I had to go over to one of the little checkouts to get another bag, to get another bag for life well not bag for life but one of those cheap 5p pieces of shit or 10p pieces of shit and um, as I was over there I looked over there was some bloke scanning a fucking Snickers bar on my checkout cheeky bastard so I went back over and I said excuse me can't you see that I'm already halfway through the bloody shopping and he was like uh. it was like bloody Neil from the young ones without the hair uh, uh. yeah <laughs> probably so fucking doped up don't know where he is so i had to then wait for the lady to come and delete that bloody item off my checkout which took about four or five minutes and added to my bleeding precious time i've got today cheeky little bastard up off to your own sodding checkout you mop head twat anyway Right, okay, that's my little rant out of the way. Is it Wednesday? No, it's not. Right, okay, so we are done here at Westwood Cross. <laughs> not much is going on, really. Noisy git. <laughs> anyway, hop down to Dover now. Um, I think we'll probably do our last 
shop of the day, which will be Poundland in Dover. I'm not holding much hope out over this one. So um, I think probably the only pickup today is going to probably be that. Yeah. No pickups. I'm starting to bleed in resemble wet movie one. He goes out, he never picks any f bloody Blu-rays up. Every studio in the country sends him bloody free stuff to review, cheeky bastard. Call himself Blu-ray hoarder. Cheeky whippersnapper. We love the wet movie, really. But uh, yes, anyway, cheeky little side. So I am now going down to Dover and I'm going to have a look in Poundland and see if there's any Blu-rays to salvage today. Because this week, Blu-ray wise, is been pretty bad. I'll see you down at Dover. Okay, let's go in and have a look in Poundland and see if they've got anything. Okay, let's have a look, see what we've got here, see if we've got anything new. Uh, we've got the Wall Street Money Never Sleeps from a couple of weeks ago. Uh, Anchorman 2, Seth Paul. Anonymous, Anonymous. That one. Uh, Epic 3D, that's a new one. By the A Team, Rio 2, another South Paul, plus District 9. Underworld non stop. Hangover. Which one's that? That's the original Transformers. Thank you. Los Angeles. That's about it, I think. Twat headed reptilian gormless twat headed monkey nut breath twats. Yes, okay, so I've just come from Poundland where there wasn't really anything worth picking up. There was a little old lady, she was taking fucking ages looking through the CDs and I was lurking behind her. I swear she thought I was going to nick her fucking bag. But anyway, yes, walking over. Oh, God, me, dear me, bloody Poundland. As soon as I walked in the door, it's like 20 people had gone to see Avengers Endgame, held it for three hours, and pissed everywhere. God almighty, I needed a peg walking through Poundland. Someone's decided to let it out. God damn me. Uh, yes, and then I went to go into CEX, and CEX is just closed. Bollocks. Um, and to top it all off, I was just crossing over at the crossing there. Bloody light was red. Bus stopped. Car stopped. Bloody motorbike went straight through the middle of them, straight through the red lights, and fucked off down the road. Not even a sodding number plate on the back of the bike. Bastards. What is going on around here? It's like the whole town is bloody occupied by lame brain drugged up inbreds what is going on it never used to be like this in dover it used to be a lovely place to live there used to be shops occupied there used to be nice helpful people not gormless twat-headed monkey nut shit-faced wank breaths walking around <laughs> oh god oh my god oh dear and this was supposed to be a lovely blu-ray hunting day bollocks okay so what did i pick up One birthday card and a pack of fucking ibuprofen. Oh, and a bottle of Diet Coke. That's all today's pickups. Oh, God. Hopefully we'll have better luck next week or the week after. Oh, dear me. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's Blu-ray hunt. I'm exhausted. I'm bloody exhausted. I haven't been this exhausted since I stayed up all night watching a 20-episode marathon of Buffy with Lulu. 
Shit in bollock brains. Oh dear me. Yes, I'm going to go home now, chill out, edit the video together, get it uploaded so that you can all laugh your asses off. Because uh, today's been a bit of a weird one again. We get these weird ones every now and again. Some bloke is looking through the bloody window at me. Like, what the hell is this bloke yapping on about? <laughs> Walk on, you twat. Yes, okie dokie. Right, so I hope you enjoyed the video. <sighs> Dear me. Uh, like it by giving it a thumbs up. Uh, share the video with everybody. Just share it. Share my rant <laughs> with as many people as you can. And um, don't forget to subscribe. Stick down in the comments if you did pick anything up today. Oh, God, there's another load of people just walking past the car. Looking in the car. What's wrong with you? <sighs> yes. Um, where was I? Yes, subscribe. Um, oh, head over to Patreon. I'm, do you know what? I might just upload a load of bloody rants onto Patreon. So go and sign up and have a laugh on Patreon. And um, yeah, stick down in the comments if you actually bought anything today, unlike me. And um, I'll see you on the next, hopefully, karma video. <laughs> what the fucking hell is going on today? Right, I'm off home for a cup of tea. Bye.